So, I've discovered my solution to my broken nipple on my uh, first solenoid right there. It's supposed to be that long. It's only that long. And I'm pretty sure I can't get a vacuum hose attached to that. I went to AutoZone and I bought some barb fittings. And I'm going to try and find a barb fitting that will fit in there, shove it in there, and then JB weld it in. So that's what I'm going to do right now. So, uh... If this little variety pack has the correct size, which I'm hoping it does, it's a useful tip if you ever do any kind of swap with an intake manifold, whether it be a new one or an aftermarket one or this one or whatever, if you break one of these nipples, this is going to be how you're going to fix it. Give me one second to open this. Probably gonna have to just go with the smallest one. Let's try this one first. Uh, it's not gonna work. No, that one didn't work. Oh, that's the one. It doesn't go in that much, but after I JB weld it in, it'll be the fix. I don't know, it doesn't say a size on it, but kind of shove it in there. Just like that. My solution now fixed. Well, whatever you want to call it. But yeah, so, take that in mind, if you ever do uh, uh, any kind of swap with an intake manifold, whether it be a stock one or not, if you get break, because apparently these are easy to break, so if you break uh, one of the nipples, just buy a variety of barb pack, can't even see what it says anymore, it was returned one, and you'll get a bunch of them that you can, you know, probably use some other time, and then you got your one, that'll fit. And what I'm going to do now... Well, not right now, but now that I have that on there, I'm just going to JB weld around it, and then it'll be, you know, basically plastic welded to the verse solenoid. And uh, I'll be good to go.